let me show you how i made this wig in under 30 minutes using a no sewing machine so i'm using packet hair but you can use whichever hair you wish to use whether synthetic or human hair you're also going to need got to be free spray or any max hold free spray that you have as well as lace glue i don't have the quick weave glue as well as a measuring tape and needle and thread so basically we'll be making a quick weave but make it a wig so i'm using a 22 inch canvas head pop the wig cap onto it and i'm making my guidelines using the measuring tape as well as chalk so i'm making my guidelines an inch apart that is because i don't want a full wig if you do want a fuller wig you can make them 0.5 inches apart or even 0.75 inches apart just make sure that you sew the closure on to the wig cap before you even begin with the tracks so before you begin gluing the tracks on to the wig cap you need to make sure that you measure the length that you will need for each line so now let's get into the meat and potatoes of this tutorial so i'm adding glue on to the tracks and then sticking it on to my wig cap and finishing it off with some got to be Then I'll do the same for the next line. Determine how much I need, pre-cut the length that I need, add some glue. So now here I'm adding glue on directly onto the wig cap. So if you find that adding glue to the track is too much work, you can add the glue directly onto the wig cap. And then if there's any loose tracks, just go in with more glue like you see I'm doing here. And then finishing off with got to be glue the rest of the wig is pretty much repetitive steps the same steps that i just did using those guides that we drew and that is how you make a closure wig at home in under 30 minutes using no sewing machine now if you want to make it glueless and custom sized like i did make sure to check out this video right here to learn how to make a custom wig cap